Who was John Singer Sargent? John Singer Sargent was an American artist who was considered the leading portrait painter of his generation. Top 5 Most Famous Paintings by John Singer Sargent Portrait of Madame X by John Singer Sargent Virginie Amélie Evegno Gautreau, also known as Madame X, was born in Louisiana. She was high society woman who was famous for her elegant appearance. Sargent attempted to increase his own fame by painting and depicting her beauty in this portrait. He did so by working without a commission to emphasize her daring personality and style. After he finished the portrait he received more mockery than appreciation at the Paris Salon of 1884, Sargent repainted the epaulette and kept the painting. When he finally sold it to the Metropolitan Museum, he said, I think it's the best thing I've ever done, but asked the museum to hide the model's name that he used for the painting. 2. Carnation, Lily, Lily, Rose by John Singer Sargent. The painting depicts two children lighting up Chinese lanterns in a garden. The inspiration for the unique piece came during an 1885 boating trip, when Sargent took with him fellow painter Edwin Austin Abbey. During that evening on the water, near the Thames at Pangbourne, they saw Chinese lanterns hanging from trees spreading light over a bed of flowers. After Pangbourne, Sargent stayed with his artist friend, Francis David Millet at Farmhouse in Broadway, Worcestershire, and there he began working on this painting. Sargent's progress was slow. He worked on the painting from September 1885 and completed it sometime in October 1886. Sargent was determined to recreate the light effect from Pangbourne, and he only painted a few minutes every evening to capture the essence he felt of light at dusk. If you have enjoyed the video so far, we would really appreciate it if you would subscribe to our channel. Let's know if you want more videos like this, by hitting the like button, now back to the video. 3. El Haleo by John Singer Sargent. Sargent was motivated by a five-month trip he made throughout Europe and North Africa in 1879. Sargent came back to Paris and started working on this enormous canvas. The name El Haleo alludes to importance of Haleo dance. The painting incorporates the Haleo essence with bright lights, a dancing model, and dark colors. 4. The Daughters of Edward Darley Boyd by John Singer Sargent. When Sargent arrived in Boston in 1887, the Boyd family hosted him at their home and immediately commissioned a portrait from him. Sargent painted this painting while he was in Paris, it was an important composition early on in his career. 5. Lady Agnew of Lochna by John Singer Sargent. Lady Agnew is portrayed in an 18th-century French bergère. Sargent painted her in a three-quarter length canvas, wearing a white outfit with a silk mauve band as an embellishment around her midsection. The cloth behind her is Chinese silk of a bluish color. She looks straightforwardly, her expression expresses she is participating in a close discussion with the artist. Art history specialist Richard Ormond said the rear of the seat is utilized as a bending, supporting space to contain the figure, making an unmistakable, lazy elegance. Ormond and Kilmeray comment that she was convalescing from flu when she was modeling for this portrait which may explain her drowsiness look.